Welcome to the Worldwide Center of Mathematics. Today we're on our series, The Top Pop Math Chops, at uh, hashtag Math Chops. We're talking about the, uh, the proof of the uncountability of the, or the real numbers. And um, the real numbers are anything that can be shown on a number line, which is a number line goes to infinity and negative infinity. So you have um, natural numbers, 0, 1, 2, uh, integers, negative 1, negative 2, um, irrational numbers, square root of 2, then you have fractions and other decimals along the number line. So um, George Cantor proved this using uh, set theory um, and kind of looking at the mapping of um, sets to uh, the natural numbers. And if you're able to have a one-to-one cor -one correspondence between the natural numbers and the set you're mapping, then it is considered a countable set. Um, so let's look at that. So if we were to map something like the even numbers to the, uh, to the natural numbers, you're able to map every even number and a one-to-one -one correspondence with the natural numbers. So the even numbers are a countable set as they go to infinity. Um, Cantor then would go on to look at the real numbers from the open set 0 to 1 um, and then the decimal expansions of those. So looking at these numbers, these are real numbers. They are on the number line um, in between 0 and 1. Um, and then what Cantor did was he looked at each of these numbers. These are just arbitrary numbers using zeros and 1s um, as decimals. He looked at the diagonal of these numbers. And then looking at uh, these diagonals, we can create a new number. And 
And so this new number looking, which was created from the diagonals, is uh, 0 0.0001. And then after finding this number, you would swap every 0 with a 1 and every 1 with a 0. And then this number will be a number that is nowhere to be found on this list because in the first number, the first, um, the first value is different. In the second number, the second decimal uh, is different. In the third, the third number here, the third place value is different, and so on and so forth. So this value would then be added to the list. And then you could do it again with this new number, and then you'll have, um, if you were to do the di diagonalization again, you'll find a, a, another number that is not on this list. So that's how George Cantor showed that um, the real numbers are uh, uncountable. Um, so thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video, um, check out the other math chops. Um, please suggest any other proofs or um, kind of tidbits you'd like to see. And uh, thank you.